so rich well you could argue it maybe n isn't the result we wanted but it is a very credible draw against a very good side isn't it they're a fantastic side you know they, they've proven it in the league above um some of the stuff they played out there and the players have got a fantastic credit to stockport really but we give it a go we give it a go a little bit high and a few little bit of disappointments you know so you've got to take stock of that but you know we've we've held a very good side to 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 draw and it could have gone either way we could have won it and we could have lost it is that credit to our side that we are a bit disappointed having drawn against well, the side of that stature i think so you know i think it's how far we're coming as a group because the group of lads are good um we know our strengths we know our weaknesses and if we can brush up on a couple of things and, and be a bit more consistent you know um we could have won the game today and uh, let's talk about the game what, what were your thoughts are about it it was, it was a bit pretty end-to-end -end, wasn't it it was a bit even but we definitely edged it in parts yeah i think first half we were we were we were probably disappointed to come in at half time not winning the game you know especially the first 10 15 minutes we score and you know i think we kept the lead for three minutes so you know that's tough and then you start the second half like we did and you're, you're up against it but again you know the the attitude of the lads are, just get on with it. Let's let's see what we can do. I mean, the second goal is just fant fantastic ball in from Lawrence, and and the finish from Josh is is fantastic. It's just a good goal. You seem to be saying this to yourself, to Hugo, to Tommy every time we have a an interview. But it, it's just one of these things, isn't it? Where the team is the team plays so well, it's hard to pick out individuals. But in a lot of the games, we do have fantastic individual performances, such as Josh Stokes getting the two goals today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looked to me, it looked like they gave they gave the our club, Stockport gave our club and, and Josh massive, massive credit and, re and respect. It looked like they tried to man mark him, you know, and that's why one lad has to go off before half time because of the booking and potentially another booking. Um, so yeah, we've got some good individuals, and, and you know, Josh will always get a lot of prodded. So will Lauren, but we've got we've got some, we've got a good little squad here, and we'll, we'll keep on going. Exactly, because it is a squad, isn't it? The players that aren't even in the eleven. We only made one sub today, but you know the players that were sat on the bench, they they can come on and change the game. We've got a few injuries as well, haven't we? So it's it's a brilliant squad. Isn't it? It's a good squad. The injuries, are, there's some big injuries coming back as well, which is a bonus because you know we've got another game to play as well now, and there's no one in the squad we wouldn't be worried about putting on in the starting eleven. You know we've got a lot of faith in our squad. Um, like I say, the character is massive. Just just gets go from strength to strength and, and like you say that's why we're probably a little bit disappointed but um, not being in the strength of the third round. Stuart O'Keefe and Ollie Scott are two of those players that are in the squad today can, well, can you give us an update on them are they pretty much ready to go? They're getting, they're, they've been in full training for a couple of days or a week um, depending on which one you're talking about so you know they've been out for quite a long time so you know they need to get sharper um, I would like to say Stuart with the experience would be happy to go and go and play because he, he can read the game and he can manage his own body. Ollie's probably the same, you know, when, when Ollie's played for us he's, he's been he's been good. You know, you look away at Fylde, you know, he's marking six foot four lads in the box yeah. and, and fighting his corner. So like I say, there are two good players coming back and you've got one or two um, close again. So you know the squad the squad's strong because we will get suspensions and we will get injuries and everybody will play the part this season. Aaron Jones was named on the bench. Does that mean his injury isn't maybe as bad as we first feared? Yeah, he's, he's done a bit of, bit of light training and what have you. Um, so, you know, we've got a trophy. We've got a trophy coming up next week, you know, and then, then we're back in the league. So he's got a week to get fit for that or fitter um, or, or, for the, or for the league. So we've got a lot of things to think about before that game. You know, we've just finished the game. So it'll be sort of a day off and rest, recovery day on Tuesday. So we'll know more about AJ and what have you because he's a warrior. He wants to, he wants to play every game, you know. So it's hard to hard to rein him back. But that's why when Stu is not here, he's our captain and he's a, he's a voice in the change room and he's a voice on the pitch. And obviously, it won't be immediately this week, but we have got the replay to look forward to. What are your initial thoughts on that? Are we going to go there and just give it our all? Give us a break. I'm just getting over this game, mate. So we'll give it a go. You know, we, 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 we've got a fighting chance. You know, most people will think here this was our chance because we're at home and. They might be right, they might be wrong, but you know we've got a lot of faith in our players and, and what we do. So, so we've got trophy and league way before that, so we'll concentrate on the FA Cup after that, they're finished.